Imagine the thrill of standing at the peak of a snow-capped mountain, a board strapped to your feet, and nothing but miles of untouched powder stretching out before you, the adrenaline pumping through your veins as you prepare to carve your path down the slope. This, my friends, is the exhilarating world of snowboarding. Snowboarding, a sport that has exploded in popularity over the last few decades, has an intriguing history. It all started in the 60s. A young engineer named Sherman Poppin, living in Michigan, bound two skis together to create a toy for his daughter. He called it a snurfer, a blend of snow and surfer. Little did he know, he had sparked the beginning of a new sporting phenomenon. The 70s saw the sport evolve beyond a simple backyard pastime. Dmitriya Milovich, an East Coast surfer, took inspiration from the surfing and skateboarding culture of the time. He developed a snowboard called Winter Stick, inspired by the feel of surfing on snow. His invention caught the attention of Newsweek magazine, giving snowboarding its first taste of the limelight. As the 80s rolled in, snowboarding began to take a more recognizable form. Jake Burton Carpenter, a name now synonymous with snowboarding, introduced a board with bindings, a game changer. This allowed for more control and stunts, transforming snowboarding from a novelty to a serious sport. Throughout the 90s, snowboarding continued to grow in popularity. It was recognized by major sporting events, with the first snowboarding world championships taking place in 1991. Only seven years later snowboarding was given its ultimate recognition. It was included in the Winter Olympics in Nagano, Japan. The 21st century has seen snowboarding reach new heights. From the backcountry slopes to the Olympic podiums, the sport has become a staple in winter sports culture. It has pushed the boundaries of what is possible, with athletes performing gravity-defying stunts and carving out paths on near-vertical slopes. So, there you have it. A journey from a backyard toy to Olympic recognition. The story of snowboarding is one of evolution and innovation, a testament to the human spirit's quest for adrenaline and adventure. It has grown from a humble idea into a global phenomenon that continues to push the boundaries of winter sports. In summary, snowboarding has evolved from a simple backyard pastime in the 60s into a globally recognized sport, thanks to the innovations and the relentless pursuit of thrill and adventure by athletes and enthusiasts alike. Its history is a testament to the sport's spirit, demonstrating that with a bit of creativity and a love for the snow, anything is possible. In the wake of its impressive legacy, what lies in store for snowboarding? As we look to the future, the possibilities are endless. The sport continues to evolve, driven by continuous innovation in equipment and techniques. Snowboards are becoming lighter, stronger and more flexible, allowing for even more daring tricks and stunts. And let's not forget the rise of indoor snowboarding parks and virtual reality snowboarding, these new platforms are making the sport more accessible, allowing enthusiasts to shred the slopes without the need for actual snow, a game-changer for countries where snow is a rarity. Thanks to these innovations, snowboarding is poised to expand its reach even further. From the icy slopes of the Alps to the digital landscape of virtual reality, snowboarding is breaking barriers and conquering new territories. The increasing popularity of the sport in countries with no snow is a testament to this. In the end, the future of snowboarding is bright and we can't wait to see where it takes us next. From the peaks of snow-capped mountains to our very living rooms, snowboarding continues to redefine the limits of adventure and thrill. As we strap on our boots and wax our boards, we look forward to the endless possibilities that lie ahead. Snowboarding has not only revolutionized the world of winter sports, but it has also made a significant imprint on popular culture. Let's take a closer look. First, let's talk fashion. Baggy pants, oversized jackets, beanies, and goggles. These are not just for the slopes anymore. Snowboarding attire has become a style statement influencing streetwear trends worldwide. Next, we have music. From punk rock and hip-hop to electronic music, snowboarding videos have always been a platform for emerging artists and genres. They've shaped the soundtrack of the sport and in turn, influenced our playlists. The silver screen hasn't been left untouched. Films like Out Cold and Chalet Girl and documentaries like The Art of Flight have brought the thrill and culture of snowboarding into our living rooms, inspiring a new generation of riders. Beyond culture, snowboarding has played a key role in promoting environmental awareness. Riders and fans alike are drawn to the pristine beauty of the mountains, leading to an increased sensitivity towards preserving these natural playgrounds. Snowboarding companies are also stepping up, producing eco-friendly gear and advocating for climate change action. 
And let's not forget the inspiring stories of snowboarding athletes overcoming adversity, proving that with determination and passion, no obstacle is too great. In the end, snowboarding is more than just a sport, it's a lifestyle. It's about freedom, creativity, and a love for the great outdoors. Its impact is far-reaching and it continues to shape our world in surprising and exciting ways.